The critical path method has been around since the 1940s. The question is, do we still need CPM? What does it do for us? CPM is the bedrock of all the software tools that you would use to plan a project. You can't build a skyscraper or launch a refinery upgrade in one suite. CPM helps break those big goals into smaller manageable chunks. Sequenced, prioritized, so teams know exactly what to focus on and when. CPM really gives you a roadmap. It's the tool that connects tasks in a logical time-based plan and helps us identify the fastest route to complete the work. So CPM gives you a visual, trackable plan with a Gantt chart so you can monitor progress, spot delays, make informed decisions before small issues become big problems. Now the question is, why do you need to know it? Michael, uh, the computer does all of the calculations, like why do I need to know what's happening? You need to understand how the computer does it because scheduling is a very technical discipline with a lot of scrutiny. Even if you're not planning to be a scheduler, you need to understand all these concepts, total float, critical path, driving relationship. If you're pursuing your PMP or pursuing your PSP, all of this stuff comes up. If we're all looking at the schedule, but don't have any understanding of how the computer came up with these dates, you're gonna be at a loss. Understanding how the computer assigned a date to work is gonna be vitally important. So don't be left behind the team. You're gonna learn the semantics and the mechanics of how CPM works in this course, internalize it, get it into your bones because it's important. I'm Michael. I'm the founder of Plan Academy. I've been teaching students to use scheduling software like Primavera P6 Professional for years. And something that became a problem for me was how many students mastered software but actually missed the underlying concepts of the critical path method. This course is really going to help you grasp the foundational concepts and language of project scheduling without us getting bogged down with software. We'll take a deep dive on how the critical path method works. So you'll recognize it when you're working in a tool like Primavera or Microsoft. On completing the course and the quiz, you'll earn your CPM master credential. There's lots to learn here, so I'll see you in the course video.